for me to join the entire Makerere University community in extending a warm welcome to Your Excellency, the President of the Republic of Uganda. Thank you very much for joining us to this main event for the commemoration of 100 years of Makerere University. Your presence in our midst today confirms once again your consistent and unwavering commitment to the improvement of education in Uganda. We thank you wholeheartedly for sparing your precious time to join us in this once in a lifetime centennial commemoration of Makerere University from 1922 to 2022. As your excellency is aware, the history of our country in starting and sustaining institutions that serve the critical needs of our people well is still largely in formative stages. We hope and pray that the growth and maturity which McKinley has attained in research and teaching over the last 100 years can serve as an example to other national institutions to not only survive, but also attain excellence in serving our people and the world. Your Excellency, thank you very much for the historical revolution of your administration in providing universal access to education through universal primary education and universal secondary education. It is a fundamental challenge to all Ugandans to rise to the core to ensure that our children get quality education. Despite the tough challenges of raising quality in public institutions, Makerere University's global ranking as a first-class university shows that public institutions can actually achieve excellent performance. This is important because sometime, some years back, we were being told that public institutions cannot be good, that they should be sold out or closed. But actually, the history of Makerere University and its standing in our country is proof that public institutions can actually achieve excellence. According to NDP3, 92% of all parishes now have a government-aided primary school, and 71% of all sub-counties have a government-aided secondary school. Additionally, all major regions of the country have a public university. Given this remarkable access to education, one of the key challenges we now face is to improve the quality and sustainability of these institutions. This challenge applies also to institutions in other sectors, such as health, finance, agriculture, transportation, and construction. Strong institutions are indeed a fundamental prerequisite for quality services in all sectors of our society. Allow me to challenge Makerere University and all other education institutions in Uganda to also put greater emphasis on the ethical content of education. The character of our graduates is no less important than their technical knowledge. We already have abundant evidence of teachers who either do not teach or teach relevant subject matter, as well as health workers who are persistently absent from duty for hours and even days. The quality of service delivery 
in public institutions remains a key challenge for our country. It is a great relief to us all to note that Makerere University has largely risen to this challenge to improve and sustain quality services. It is my sincere prayer that Makerere will lead the way for our country to ensure quality services to our people through sustainable and robust institutions. I thank the Chairperson of Council and her members for excellent work in ensuring proper oversight over the university. I also thank the Vice Chancellor and his team for strict adherence to high standards of performance in all areas of the university. I thank the faculty and staff for the great work they do behind the scenes, inside and outside the classrooms. And I thank the students for knowing why they are here and for being committed to their calling. Thank you all for carrying Makerere to 100 years. I thank Your Excellency and our First Lady and Minister of Education for the amazing support to Makerere through funding for academic programs, research, innovation, and the ongoing reconstruction of our main hall following the tragic fire of September 2021. Thank you ever so much for being here to launch Makerere University toward the next 100 years. Let me also assure our development partners that we do greatly value and appreciate their extensive support for numerous critical research programs they have been funding during the past 100 years. Thank you very much, our development partners. Your Excellency, before I sit down, allow me to mention that in 1980, I was a senior lecturer here, and with my colleague, Joshua Mjenyi, we started the Uganda National Movement here at Makerere because we were bothered by the extreme chaos in our country. And you invited us, Joshua Mjini and I, may he so rest in peace. And we came and joined you to form the Uganda Patriotic Movement, which later became your National Resistance Movement. So, Makere may not be aware that we had a small footprint also in the current movement which you lead. Thank you very much. With, I have been told I was supposed to invite the first lady, but since she's not here, I think I'll leave it to the MC to invite the next speaker. Thank you very much. <laughs>